a big part in moving on and also Sorry, a really Olivia. part hi guys welcome to my youtube video this is my first time filming in a very long time also don't mind my eyelashes we may or may not be getting them done today um how are you guys doing i haven't made a youtube video in a really long time so look how insane my hair is too but yeah so i just made my bed and clean up my room a little bit so that we can go to the gym. So let's go ahead and go to the gym. Also, my nail fell off. Okay. If I were to give you any advice at the gym, it would be to do 12, 3, 30. 12, 3, 30. And it's basically like you walk for 30 minutes, um, incline on 12 and um, speed on three. If there's one thing I do every day, there's two things I do every day, and that is abs and calves. So I know you're not probably supposed to, but I do it, so it works for me.
So I am on the Stairmaster right now. But I wanted to take the time and talk about um, like most of the workouts that I do um, work for me a lot. Um, they might not work for other people. Try to push yourself, but don't push yourself so hard to the point where you get injured. Also, another thing, which is kind of obvious, but sometimes it's not obvious for some people. Um, consistency is key. So I at least go to the gym six to five days a week. Um, at least an hour. And um, <clears throat> today was booty and abs, which. I do abs most of the time, um, just because I feel like it, I don't know, and calves too, because those are two main things that I like to work on, um, and I'm going to be on here for about 10 minutes and then I'm going to go. Stairmaster for like five minutes <laughs> because I feel like my body was dead and I want to be able to go to the gym tomorrow but I am on my way to go get my lashes done because I look like a freaking mole rat but it's okay not all of us look perfect all the time okay also I wanted to say that everybody's bodies are different so if this workout is too difficult for you if this workout is too easy for you just know that you could always progress or you could always um, you know hire the weight or whatever is needed for your body um, and yeah be kind to yourself work out for yourself don't work out for nobody don't work out for a man don't work out for a woman work out for yourself because you want to be healthy you want to be strong you want to so the reason why I'm explaining so much about like basically like working out for yourself is because um, a lot of you have been asking me for like a workout tutorial and honestly like it's so much more than just like working out if you're sad if you feel like so bad about yourself and like it's a form of therapy and like if if you feel like you need to do something to better your life going to the gym is so amazing because i know it's hard at first to go to the gym it really is but once you get used to the routine like pick a time in your day like pick a time 10 a.m like i don't know anytime you want to go to the gym sometimes there's days where i feel like i don't want to go to the gym but like my body is telling me like you're going to regret not going to the gym because it literally is a form of therapy it's like the best thing in the world i love it so just know that like it's more than just like making your body healthier and look better or whatever. So yeah. Okay, love you. Live your life to the fullest and you want your dream body, right? For yourself only. That's all that matters. And I'm gonna leave it off at that. And um, if you guys ever need any like video recommendations for when you do the 12, 3, 30, uh, let me know because I watch every single day, I watch The Wizard Liz. And there's another girl that I watch. Um, I'll probably put it up on the screen right here. But I do watch a lot of self-help. Self-help? Like self-improvement YouTube videos. Because honestly, the wizard Liz is the best. And I love her so much. And she takes care of me. And she's my therapist. And I love her. So I hope you all have an amazing day, amazing night, or whatever time it is for you. And I'll see you guys.